Today we are going to present you the detailed procedure for preparing culture media for microbiological analysis. Accurate preparation is crucial, as improperly made media can hinder microbial growth and lead to incorrect results. Always follow the manufacturer's instructions closely. Culture media are primarily used for the cultivation of bacteria and fungus, microbiological analysis or examination, and microbial isolation and identification. Welcome to Microchem's experiments. We can prepare culture media following five steps, dissolving media ingredients in water, sterilization of culture media, pH checking adjustment, addition of media supplements, distribution of culture media. For the preparation of culture media, we need biological safety cabinet, autoclave, electronic balance, pH meter, water bath, sterile petri dish, hot plate with magnetic stirrer, microwave oven, common laboratory apparatus and glassware, ready culture medium powder, and necessary supplements. Let's go to the laboratory for the culture media preparation. In the first step, we are going to dissolve media constituents in purified water. In this video, we will prepare 250 milliliters of an agar culture medium. Firstly, measure 250 milliliters distilled water in a suitable container. We should always use distilled water or deionized water for media preparation. Now, we have to weigh sufficient amount of dehydrated media. Let's calculate how much dehydrated media is necessary for 250 milliliters water. As per the manufacturer's instructions, we need to suspend 63 grams media in 950 milliliters distilled water. So, in 250 milliliters water, we need to dissolve 16.578 grams media. Now, take weight of about 16.578 grams of dehydrated culture media. Suspend the dehydrated culture media in the previously measured 250 milliliters water. We should always follow the manufacturer's instructions during the preparation. Now, we have to boil the mixture to dissolve the media constituents in water completely. Boiling can be done either by using water bath, using hot plate with magnetic stirrer or using microwave oven. Media should be boiled in water bath at 100 degrees Celsius. Water bath temperature should be set at 100 degrees Celsius. 
Put the mixture container into the boiling water of water bath. Boil the content for 5 minutes. Swell the container to mix the content. Put the container back again into the boiling water. Again, boil the content for 5 minutes. Swell the container again to mix the content. Boil the content for another 5 minutes. In this way, keep boiling the mixture until it becomes transparent. The media is dissolved completely. Now, the media is ready for the sterilization process. We can use hot plate instead of water bath for boiling of media. Now, we will show you how to use hot plate with magnetic stirrer for dissolving the media. Put a magnetic bar into the media container. Put the container on the hot plate. Turn on the hot plate and set the hot plate temperature at 100 degrees Celsius to 120 degrees Celsius. Turn on the magnetic stirring. In this way, apply heat to boil the mixture until it becomes transparent. You can see that the mixture is not completely become transparent. So, keep boiling for another 10 minutes. Now you can see that the media is dissolved completely as it became transparent. The media is ready for the sterilization process. We can also use microwave oven for dissolving the media. Put the media container into the microwave oven and close the chamber. Heat the media at 100 degrees Celsius to 120 degrees Celsius until boiling starts. After few seconds of boiling, stop heating and take out the container. Swirl the container. Put the container back again into the oven and apply heat again. In this way, keep boiling the mixture until it becomes transparent. Now you can see that the media is dissolved completely as it became transparent. The media is ready for the sterilization process. In this step, we will sterilize the culture media. 
Sterilization should be done using an autoclave to heat the media at 121 degrees Celsius temperature and 15 pounds pressure for 15 minutes, as per manufacturer's instructions. For sterilization, keep the media and other necessary items into the autoclave basket. Keep the basket inside of the autoclave. Close the autoclave chamber tightly. Now, start the autoclaving at 121 degrees Celsius temperature and 15 pounds pressure for 15 minutes. Once autoclaving is done, take out the media from the autoclave. Now we have to check the pH of the sterilized culture media. Because pH value is very important for microbial growth. Cool the sterilized media at 47 degrees Celsius by transferring the container into water bath. Temperature compensated pH meter should be used to get accurate pH reading. Prepare pH meter for the pH measurement of the culture media. After cooling the media at 47 degrees Celsius, take out it from the water bath. Transfer a small amount of the media into the small narrow beaker. After transferring, the media should be kept back into the water bath immediately. The media temperature should be maintained at 47 degrees Celsius. Now, insert the pH meter probe rapidly into the media and take the pH reading. Wait until getting the stable pH reading. As per manufacturer's instructions, pH value of the media should be fall between 6.8 to 7.2. We can see that our prepared media have suitable pH value, 6.94. So, the pH value completely complies the media requirements, Our prepared medium needs to add some additional supplements. So, before addition of the supplements, we must ensure that the temperature of the sterilized media is maintained at 47 degrees Celsius. Once the media is cooled at 47 degrees Celsius, it becomes ready to add heat-sensitive supplements. Take the media inside of the biosafety cabinet during addition of the supplements. At first, we will add 30% egg yolk emulsion into our media. Video link for the egg yolk emulsion preparation is given in the description section of this video. As per manufacturer's instructions, we have to add 13.157 ml of 30% egg yolk emulsion. You can also use commercially available 30% egg yolk emulsion. Before addition, warm the emulsion at 47 degrees Celsius in water bath. Now, transfer 13.157 ml egg yolk emulsion into the media. Swell the container to mix the content. Now, we will add our second supplement 3.5% potassium telluride solution. Video link for the potassium telluride solution preparation is given in the description section of this video. 
As per manufacturer's instructions, we have to add 0.789 milliliters of 3.5% potassium telluride solution. Before addition, warm the potassium telluride solution at 47 degrees Celsius in water bath. You can also use commercially available potassium telluride solution. Now, add 0.789 milliliters of 3.5% potassium telluride solution into the media content. Swell the container to mix the content. If the media is intended to use for pour plate technique, you can use it now. If the media is prepared for spread or streak plate technique, follow the next step for media distribution into plates. We should always use sterile petri dishes to prepare agar plates. Pour about 15 to 20 milliliters prepared culture media into each of the petri dishes. Cool the culture media inside of the biosafety cabinet to become solidified. After 20 minutes of cooling, close the plates with their lids. Culture media plates are completely ready to use in the microbiological analysis. Store the prepared plates at 2 to 8 degrees Celsius, if not used immediately.